Hi, I'm Rebecca Cunningham. And I'm Hal Bean. And we are parishioners at College Church, and we'd like to take an opportunity to share with you why we are voting yes on Amendment 2, which is to expand Medicaid in the state of Missouri. I'm a scientist, but after my graduate training, decided to also pursue a career in medicine because I realized that while I do love my biology and my research, I also desire to interact with patients and care for the whole person. In my first year of medical school, I had the opportunity to witness firsthand how inadequate access to health care can significantly impact health outcomes. It's horrifying to me that patients have to choose between the cost of medication and other essentials in life because of the prohibitive cost of health care without Medicaid. As Catholics, I think that it should invoke righteous anger at us, that our sisters and brothers in Christ are significantly affected by poor health outcomes simply because of lack of access to health care, which in turn can undermine how our brothers and sisters fully participate in the body of Christ. We have a chance to make a small but significant impact to improve access to Missourians through Medicaid expansion. If we vote yes to ensure that fellow community members can see a good doctor, obtain medication, and seek preventative care, then we also vote to support the well-being of our city and our state. I think we've all seen how a significant role health plays in our community through the COVID-19 pandemic. We've seen that on a daily basis, Poor health can impact our job, our families, and our community. And access to health care should not further hinder the well-being of our community. As I said earlier, I decided to per pursue a career in medicine as a means to care for the whole person. And for me, caring for the whole person includes abdicating for my patients for access to health care through Medicaid expansion because I do not want my future patients to experience worse health outcomes simply because seeing a physician is cost prohibitive. And for me, I intend to vote yes on Amendment 2 on August 4th. Uh, Rebecca and I got married at Ch College Church a little over, uh, almost two years ago now. Uh, and during our, our, our wedding mass, uh, we were called to uh, be salt of the earth and uh, God's light here on earth. Um, and as Catholics, uh, we look to Jesus' example for how to fulfill that calling. Much of Jesus' ministry uh, was devoted to caring for the poor and healing the sick. At least three of the seven miracles of Jesus involved healing the sick. Accordingly, I believe it's incumbent upon me, as a Catholic following in the example of Jesus, to support initiatives that would care for the poor by ensuring adequate access to health care. That's exactly what Amendment 2 would do, and that's why I will vote yes on Amendment 2 on August 4th, and we hope you will do the same.